where I'm staying. This farm of 200 acres. There's maize, there's genus, and there's cassava. Here, I get my income. And when I get a big scale, I can earn more. About 68% of the farming community is peasantry. The other 32% is within the cash economy. We need to look into how do we add value to the products that are coming out of the farmers' fields. The Ministry of Agriculture is offering two public goods. The first is research, where technologies are developed and passed on to the farmer. The second is extension. Extension workers are passing the information. Farmers are using the knowledge. All of these people have got different values, different knowledges and skills to share. This knowledge sharing uh, is an important aspect of our work. We have six agencies which makes the complete Minister of Agriculture. But many times you find that the agencies work alone, the ministry works alone, and the departments also work alone. We're doing so much, but we're not sharing information quite well. The bank came in to help us, to show how we can strengthen the ministry and in the sector. This is going to be a very important aspect. There were several approaches. Group discussions, workshops, and case studies. They were guiding us to diagnose our problems and make suggestions on areas of improvement, devise solutions. And ever since, we are capturing knowledge and preparing knowledge assets for the ministry. Different departments are trying to make sure that their knowledge sharing information systems in place. We have been able to include knowledge sharing in the sector strategy and investment plan, which is a five-year document. We believe this is going to change our working habits with the farmers. We would like the farmers themselves through their experience to teach other farmers for the other farmers to adopt and follow. From the workshop, I learned that different kind of farmers were facing almost similar challenges. Now I am more knowledgeable and I believe I could be able to help someone else. We have come to get their knowledge how to fight the diseases in the farm. In fact, in general, how to handle your farm, planning, cleanliness, hygiene. We appreciate the knowledge sharing they have given us. This program has actually enabled them using a telephone to actually develop knowledge assets specific to farming communities. There are now group chats of farmers making sure that knowledge once captured is stored and made to answer targeted farmer groups the specific challenges that the farmers have. These farmers come to find a solution to the problems they have been facing, affecting their income. Through knowledge sharing, they'll improve on their management, which later on will increase production. And when someone has a steady income, he'll be eager to get more information, and you'll find even the productivity increasing. Everything that we do in agriculture to promote production is based on knowledge sharing. Nobody has all the skills necessary. We all supplement and complement each other. We have examples of organized farmers groups where they have been sharing knowledge. And they have moved just like that. It's catalytic. <laughs>